Bradford? <laughs> you can call me Kim. It's okay, Mr. Cho. Sorry to interrupt. I was looking for Megan. She's not here. I can see that. Well, uh, I'll leave you two to it then. All right, here it is. Um, uh, how much did you say this place was? Twenty-two fifty a month, minus utilities. For a one-bedroom an hour outside of the city? Well, it's a competitive market. I'm not sure I understand. You better act fast because I have other offers on this place. There's nothing more New York than this. Were she and Todd serious? Was he around a lot? They didn't fight a lot. At least, not in front of me. But they did fight. I don't know. They seemed like a great couple. Perfect, even. I can your ride home. Where's home? Like, I don't know. So can you do it? Because I told her you would. Be funny. Could you just wait outside for like 10 minutes? Yes. Go. I'm going. Um, excuse me. Yoga Molly. bullshit. Molly, that is enough. I'm really sorry, Rachel. This is never going to happen again. Believe me. She is in a lot of trouble. Get in the car right now. Well, Mr. Farquhar, uh, let's start off by talking about your television career. We have here that you've either written or executive produced 14 television shows indefinitely. You wrote for Married with Children. I love that show. Love and marriage. Love and marriage. We should just have a bake sale. Oh, come on, Kim. Not another bake sale. Last year's bake sale raised $1,000 for the fall play and it was barely enough to build the sets. Sorry, bake sales are a waste of time. Okay, then what's your great idea? Black tie fundraiser. That's not a bad idea. Mm-hmm. Okay, and where would we have this? Maybe one of our houses. I'll volunteer my house. Well then, shall we put it to a vote? Sure. Mm-hmm. That's great. Oh, come on, Kim, don't leave like that.